7.2 number 2. Here we're multiplying two rational expressions and uh, we're going to use the usual steps that we use even if they have binomials or trinomials or whatever. We're going to do the steps of factor, cancel, and then multiply at the end. Multiplying at the end uh, gives us the advantage that we're not going to end up with huge numbers that we have to try to factor. So we can go ahead and do the factoring and cancel first. Now these have monomials or single terms, so we don't have to do any factoring like we would with uh, binomials or trinomials. We can jump right to the canceling step, so we can forget about factoring. And for canceling, let's look and see if there are any factors that we could cancel out from one number on the top and one number on the bottom. So if you look at the 9, we could divide by 9 here and by 9 for the 81. That will leave us with a 1 and a 9 and then 5 and 25, they both contain a 5. So divide off the 5, divide off the 5, and then we're left with 5b cubed v to the fifth, so we do the multiply, all over 9bv cubed. And now we want to keep going, keep simplifying as far as possible, so we're going to cancel out some b's and v's. On the bottom we have 1b, on the top we have 3, so let's cancel 1 from each position and we're left with 2. And on the bottom we have 4, um, I mean 3 v's and then 5 v's on top, so let's cancel out 3 from the bottom. And if we cancel 3 from the top, that leaves us with 2 left over. So our final answer will be 5 b squared v squared all over 9.